All right, Brian. So this is really sweet news, buddy. The um, again, got to tell Paul that that we're missing him and that you haven't grown that much. All right. So the good news is here, buddy. From this down the line angle, again, one of the things you mentioned was that you're hitting it pretty dug on far, um, partly because you've grown, but partly because of the the three main factors of the distance thing. First of all is a sweet spot. Second of all is the downswing plane. Third of all is club head speed. And and again, you understood all three of those when I kind of quizzed you about it here. And this is great stuff here, man. That right at impact, you're right back in the same posture you were in your setup. Your backside is right on that line, just like when you started. And the club heads, you know, again, like you know, if you're going to miss this line, it's much better to miss it underneath it. For where you are in your development it creates a lot of distance, and that looks gorgeous there, parallel to your plane line through the top of your left shoulder. Then over here, that looks quite good in a lot of ways too, buddy. Nicely behind the ball, and there's that really good lag. And then that rehinge there as a result of the good cocking of your wrist, lag on the downswing, right through there. Hey, good to see you, man. Do you remember this guy? Yes. What's his first name? Yeah. He's grown quite a bit too, hasn't he? Yeah. yeah. What? Oh, you only love me for my range balls? All right. Don't say anything bad about Mike or Jenny or Joe or Paul or anybody else in the Dom family. This is recording. <laughs> the sound thing there. Anything else you need? man. All right. Hey, they started calling him the Rock on the St. X JV team this year because he was so consistent. So that's pretty good news. See you soon, Taylor, buddy. All right. Excuse the interruption there, Mr. Brian. So, so that's hot from that angle. And then over here, again, that real good cocking the wrist, uncocking right through there. And from this angle, yeah, there's impact. There's your setup. That's pretty cool, bud. Again, like I'm saying, especially when I've seen it on the video for several months, that's hot. Again, no real question. And again, the only question you had to was about that backswing, right? And I said, yeah, it'd be nice if you're on that plane line, and that'd be nice to work on this winter, try and get it there, because like we're saying, both you and I know that you pretty much will tend to bring it down on the same line you take it back. So if you could set up some things at home to see that a little better, that'd be smart. Do you have any other questions or observations about it? Yeah, I didn't think so. All right, bud, so let's look at that K-Vest. See that? Oh, I'll show you this. This will be kind of fun for you to see because you reminded me of this tour player. Watch this. I just want to find this one swing that would uh, make you proud here. Especially your dad. Being more my age, he'll, he'll dig this. Right there. A lot of people would die for this kind of a look over here with Hogan. And you kind of have that look there with those that left arm and that shaft. That's pretty hot, buddy. A lot of people have tried to get that their whole lives and never could get it. Now I'll show you this. Now this will look different here. Watch this. Now, I just told you how much I liked your rehinge there, all right? Because I'm seeing at your development, that's beautiful. And that's one of the reasons you're hitting it so far. Now, what I would say, though, is the years go by. Uh, how far are you hitting it with your driver? Like 220 to 240 or what? 260. Really? You the man, buddy. So now, when you're hitting it that far, especially as a little guy still, Brian, now I would actually say we might very well consider this fall and winter getting – you and I working on you getting some of that rehinge out of the swing, okay? But because uh, you see how, even though he had all that back there, now what do you think's going on there, buddy? That he looks different than you there. It's pretty advanced. That's an advanced question. 
Right, that's true. He's not rehinging as much as you are. Yeah, it's, we won't even go there. But but I'm just saying, on down the road, you may, I, you and I may decide to get you a little more like that in the follow through. But for right now, buddy, I love what you're doing, what you've done up to now. That's hot, relative to those good hands and arms action. All right, we'll stop there, buddy.